almost an Olivier award for a goal like this from Giroud. Excellent finish. Hi everyone, it's Mike and Sam. Hello. From Player One Ready, we're doing another uh, FIFA 19 Armour Team review. Mm -hmm. This one is of Team of the Group Stage, Sexy Giroud. One of the most attractive men on the planet, oh, and I'm not afraid to say that. He's beautiful. I'm delighted to say that he was at my club for six years. He's a gorgeous, gorgeous man. Multiple goals, reflected in this most handsome of cards. Anyway, yes, this Tell card. Tell us about the card, Mike. 11, game, 11 goals, 8 games, 1 assist. I Stella. think that's pretty decent. So he's got a 3-star weak foot and he's got a 3-star skill. Expected more assists. You'd think you'd get more assists with Giroud. Yeah, the way possibly, he but I didn't really, him, but... didn't really use him like that. Anyway, going into his stats, yeah. uh, you, you can do it like that with his 86 vision, 88 short passing. So we can get others into play it. as well. He does yeah. it very well. Uh, but he's got 91 positioning, 91 finishing, 80, 93 shot power, 81 long shots, 90 volleys, 91 penalties, 88 ball control, 88 reactions, 83 composure, 89 jumping, 93 strength, 99 heading accuracy. So he's a very good finisher. He's a very well-rounded striker. Yeah, good finisher, yeah. can pass, um, can head, but yeah. awful, awful, awful trying to dribble past anyone with him. Yeah. It's like driving a tank. You, you do not want to try and play yeah. this man like... So, yeah, like you don't want to try and play him with pace. Yeah, he's exactly. never been designed. No, with pace, so, so yeah, and uh, the way this is the way I designed the team. Really, I have got Ned Fed with his high crossing, high short pass or high passing. Ericsson again, high passing can cross as well. And Sterling, Sterling there, yeah. all trying to create for him. That's the way he didn't really get many assists because I was trying to create with with four, others, yeah, not yeah. with Giroud. But you can if you want to. If you want to use a target man, bounce off. Then I think he's absolutely. a multi role. Multi yeah. role striker. Also, shout out to the Michael Doyle. I'm a Cov fan, so that's there why he's there. Anyway, <laughs> so heading, I scored a few, scored a th few headers with him. All these headers are absolute peaches. Yeah, especially the second one. Yeah, I mean the, the, that one is you know yeah. standard Giroud. Nice leap on him. Yeah, exactly. You know? Really good. Really especially good if you move. get the um, timing right with the bar. Yeah, I really do that with headers, but yeah, it was really, really. I know Corner's quite easy to score headers from in this game, but very, very comfortable in the air. Um, and yeah, he was just all around putting up goal kicks to him and stuff. He won pretty much all like of them. Said, if you've got someone good at crossing as well, yeah, it was never that better. fits him really well. Yeah, exactly. So never got a few crosses in like later games when I finished the reviews. So definitely cross. Anyway, going into his finishing now, um, again, very, very good. Uh, I scored a couple. I think one or two with his right foot. I think it was just the one actually, and it was decent, but. I didn't trust it enough, and that's a con for me. You yeah. can't, if you can't really trust it, you're not really too sure about it. I mean, con. A, in real life, his weak foot isn't very good. It's all I'm right. Not surprised that it's been reflected. It's his weak foot is okay. He can use it in the same way, it, but he's like it's not his go-to. And I'm not surprised it's reflected in game. Yeah, that he's got. I mean, that is a stupidly good goal. I mean, the his, power he gets on his, his shot, shot power and finishing was very, very impressive, as we said. And for someone with talking. With his pace, I've never labelled it as a yeah. con down there. His movement, though, is actually quite good. Yeah. Um, the way he sort of actually finds space w w was useful uh, and was very, very impressive. It's just a case of um, if you're trying to sort of get past the man, or then he's not going to do Nine it. Nine so, times out of ten, you're going to lose the ball. Yeah, yeah. So exactly. So it's weird. And it's also, if you're trying to sort of play a through ball to him, he's never going to get on the end of it. But then again, he saw his first touch there was very good. His, his movement was decent. He holds his line really well. He's a player that you have to play to his strengths. To get the yeah, most exactly. If you try and do something different with him, if you try and use him as a pace striker, he's not the most versatile. You might, you know, he's built for a certain style of play. Yes, and that and is he's built for a certain style of player. Yeah. I mean, which is, you know. You're one of the most flexible FIFA players there is when it comes to putting let's in not, players. Let's not steady. Let's steady on. Let's, I'm not like... <laughs> the amount of strikers you've reviewed that have different staff. I mean, yeah. This is completely different to what we've done this before. Is, this is, this is yeah. understand, understanding a target man and knowing that you're not... If you put, It's very basic in the fact that this card is very, very good. And there are, there are people that will not like this card. They like yeah. the pace of your strikers. Like, but it, the way to use this card is bounce one-twos off him. Because mm -hmm. he's got good short passing. Would you use him in a two striker? Yeah, absolutely, I would. Yeah. Who but, would you put with him though? Um, going to use a two striker. If I was going to make a Premier League side, I'd someone like uh, someone a bit pacier, maybe someone good on the ball. Yeah. Um, maybe even someone like he's not the most pacier of strikers now, but Lacazette's got I'd decent say, I'd pace. Say Lacazette, maybe. Um, yeah. Aguero, I think he worked nicely around. Might work well with Vardy. Vardy, yeah. yeah. I mean, this this card is a very very good target man card, and yeah. if that's where you use him. Then you really will enjoy this card. There are there are flaws. His pace is. Makes him so that he can, you can only really play him into feet or play him in, in to his head. Yeah. You can't do much else than that. But you do that, you'll be perfectly fine. Yeah. So that's what I was. That's what I was getting. At. Yeah, yeah. Built for a certain. Yeah, way exactly. Of so I've given him four yeah. star because there are things missing from his game. Mm -hmm. um, to be an all-round brilliant striker, but as a target man, I think he's very, very worth it, and he's quite cheap as well. I think it's about thirty k when I bought him. Yeah, Twenty-five k now. Yeah. So I think you've got to go for it. And yeah, play to his strengths, and you will. There will. There will be people that won't like him. I'll accept yeah. that. I think everyone else should accept that but as well. If you don't like him, don't buy him. Yeah, but yeah. you know, and this way, but if you can play to that style, 
use it. And yeah. even if even if you can't, it might be it's cheap. So you could probably be able to learn from that as yeah. well and learn understand that and that role of having a target man up front. Nice. So anyway, if you like this review, uh, I've got pl- we've done plenty more. Yeah. Um, so yeah, please check him out. Of course, and we're coming to the tail end of the season now. Yeah, um, so. Team of, the season, team, of the team, of, team of the years. Team of the years. Team of the years. Have yeah, a look at. And, exactly. Anyway, yeah. Thank you very much for watching, and um, we'll see you next time. See you later.